Okay. Look at me starting on time like a boss. I'm so cool. You guys are all super jealous. Hi. Welcome, welcome to everybody. Hope that you are all doing super well. Um, for those of you who are in the U.S., I hope that you had a nice Thanksgiving and did fun stuff and had a good time and whatnot. Mine was very, very busy. Um, I'm actually still very exhausted. I'm ending up with like a five day weekend because I took off um, Wednesday and Friday. I normally don't get, get those days off, which kind of sucks, right? Um, and unfortunately, I, um, I, I couldn't do it, so yeah. Um, I had the um, I had the day off, but I didn't really take advantage of it, or I haven't been taking advantage of it because I've been working a whole bunch. So yeah, and this weekend is is no exception. Um, it's it's still my regular Saturday Sunday schedule, so lots and lots of work. Um, but yeah, I basically spent all the time cooking, getting uh, doing that. I I hosted um, Thanksgiving this year, so it was fun. It it was still a good time. Um, it was still nice to not have to wake up crazy early and go to work. I still woke up early so that I could um, do some workout stuff. So that was cool, I guess. My circuit board. Yes, your circuit board indeed. Uh, I'm trying to remember what I should do now. Uh, oh, right, that thing. I remember I was working on that last time. Like the spooky contract thing. It was very spooky. All right. So incidentally, we are back now with um, Hat in Time. I've been playing this for, for a decent while now, where I feel like I have. The Toilet of Doom? Is that like super toilet? So much clogging. <laughs> oh, come on. No, that's funny. Come on, that's hilarious. Grappling hook. Well, that's pretty cool. I don't have a grappling hook. Hopefully I'll find one. Because <laughs> I don't have one. Um, but yeah, so this is Hat in Time. It's an indie platformer game. Came out a few years ago. Um, I don't remember exactly when now. But it's just... It's plain fun. Um, I've been having an absolute blast with it, honestly. So... What's up, kiddo? Yeah. You're supposed to be cleaning the well, kid. Uh. It's deep inside the swamp, but it's big enough even a tiny thing like you can't miss it. Uh. Um, so it, it, it gives me, um, not nostalgia, but it reminds me greatly of um, Mario 64. Because... And, well, in a lot of those N64 um, games, it's very much uh, a collectathon type of shtick. So, in this case, we are collecting hourglass pieces because it represents fuel for our spaceship, um, which didn't exactly crash, but sort of crashed, essentially. Um, and so, I'm just trying to collect up the fuel again so I can get home type of shtick. So, I'm not sure exactly where this leads, but I'm excited to see it. It's nice feeling like I'm actually capable of doing some fancy platforming. That's true, it probably would be. Oh no! Dang it! I was so close, maybe. I. I uh, have no idea. Well, there's some health at least. Hooray! But yeah, I hope that everybody's Thanksgiving was good. And the rest of your guys' week. Um, I know a, a lot of people have to work on the holidays, and that sucks. One thing that I'm glad about with my, my new job, or my new-ish job, I've had it for years now, is that um, I, I'm not required to go in every day. Um, so that was one of the big issues that I had with um, doing wet lab work. So um, the, the lab that I used to work in, I was doing cell growth. 
And in order to grow the cells, I had to go in literally every single day. Doesn't matter if it's a holiday, doesn't matter if it's a weekend, I had to be there uh, because I had to take care of the cells. It was just brutal. Um, I mean, it was worth it in some ways, at least, because I got good data. And I honestly do miss being able to do some of that stuff. But, um, yeah, I don't miss the, the t massive time commitment that it required. As I, whether it's a Saturday, a Sunday, a weekend, holiday, made zero difference. Cells do not take a day off, and therefore I couldn't do it either. I remember my family would always get mad at me because I could never take vacations to see them. They're like, why can't you come and see us? I'm just like, because I gotta work. My cells are basically toddlers, but even worse. Ooh. Woohoo! Boy, that was, that was a thing, wasn't it? It was quite a trek. It's annoying being able to see all of the other relics since I'm so high up, but I can't do much about it. Okay. All right, so now we just need to go and find where I actually have to go, which is the well. I mean, this, this looks very well-ish. I'm guessing that the purple goo is not great to touch. So I remember seeing these things before. There we go. Oh shit. Let's clean the well. I'm just annoyed that my character has a hookshot thing and I don't have this hookshot thing. I could really use that. So for this particular aspect of the game or this particular part, I, I basically have sold my soul to a bad guy. And um, so in order to get it back, I need to fulfill all these contracts. It's kind of neat the way that the game is set up. Um, if you all are familiar with Super Mario 64, you remember um, the shtick with that game was you had um, you had like the different worlds with all the that had specific themes about them, and in the individual worlds, then you were um, you're basically going around and um, and you had to collect your stars, right? Oops, wrong button. Uh, whereas in this one, the idea is your your worlds are much more story driven. Oh, nice. Hookshot badge. I love it. Okay, so we need my hookshot badge. I've got it equipped. Um, 
And in this one, it's, um, so like I said, it's more story driven compared to Mario 64 in that you, um, you're sitting around and you, you go through, you do your, um, your thing, and you've got some sort of overarching whatever happening within the individual story chapters. So for this one, I've got the contract. There's another one where I have a, um, where I have a, what's it called? Um, I've got, uh, it's a competition between two groups of birds who are doing, um, who are making movies and basically trying to make the best movies. Um, there's another one where it's murder on the Orient Express type of, type of shtick. Um, so you have to go and figure out who the murderer was. Lots and lots of different things like that. It's really fun. I like it. Oh, look, it's Rev! Hi, Rev! Welcome, welcome. Good to have you, as always. And Rev resubscribed. Hooray! Thank you, Rev. Firm yet yielding multi-month support. That sounds just so terrible. So terribly terrible. I don't know. I don't know how I'm supposed to feel about this. But welcome, Rev. Excited as always to have you. I'm busy hookshotting my way to freedom. Now that I have a hookshot. Incidentally, it's literally called a hookshot, for those wondering. you guys what happened to the music this is kind of freaking me out it's nice that the hook shot is basically automatic in this game oh bugger. well that was clearly society's fault um, incidentally I hope that everybody had a, a good time with any Black Friday shopping that you all did um, I myself did do a little bit, so I'm very excited. I actually got myself some uh, some new streaming stuff, so I'm really excited. I hope that you guys appreciate it. Um, I got um, I got some what's it called? It's oh dang it! What is it? What's the brand? Like Stream Deck? It's the it's the Elgato thing. It's actually the same guys that made the uh, green screen that's behind me. Um, it's a it's a big streaming company thing, and they have like a, a big button programmable thing that you can use, um, and it has all sorts of different stuff. So it's really cool. I'm excited. I, I'm really looking forward to getting it, programming it all out. I want to have some cool death count stuff for you guys. Just trying to make my stream a little bit better, you know, that type of shtick. So very exciting. Oh look, Marathon is here too. <laughs> the Wonder Bond discussion. We had a Wonder Bra discussion yesterday where Rev said that he is basically my Wonder Bra in terms of the immense and um, continuous amount of support that has been offered, which is not wrong, unfortunately, for lack of a better term. Marathon was not able to supervise, so obviously it's not our fault. We cannot be blamed, but Marathon is here, so that's exciting. Hi, Marathon. Hi, Tiny. Great to see you both. You guys missed it when I found out about the Toilet of Doom. I am like 90% certain that it is Super Toilet, and I have to go and fix it. I have to fix the Toilet of Doom. <laughs> Marathon is giving bits so that Rev is at least less of a bra. That's very generous. I, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. I'm just getting some notifications about my work. Yay, work! Incidentally, for anybody unaware, today is Small Business Saturday. So if you all have the opportunity, please go and give some local businesses support. Um, that's kind of the shtick with today, um, after Black Friday and stuff. So it's just kind of a cool little thing that you can do. FYI. I don't know, if you all want to. Um, so, incidentally, I, I don't count as a small business. I, I don't run a business. Although, I, I, do, I, I do have my side, my side hustle. Does that count as a small business? I don't think it does, technically. 
but I do most definitely have it. And unfortunately, I do most definitely need it as well. Finally, I'll be able to get this thing. Hooray! Demoted from bra to just breath. <laughs> it's it is a tragic demotion, Rev. We we all feel for you. Ow, rude. I'm trying to think of what I need to do here. I need my other hat. Gotta go into the dark and mysterious forest of mystery and mysteriousness. Oh, and now I can actually cross this because I got the hook shot. Wait, what is this? Get on Teespring for Danny Tees? That would be kind of cool. And, and honestly, it's something I've been debating. But I'm like, my audience is Rev, Merthwin, and Tiny Human. Very consistently. We've had some cool people. So Crawfish was here... Um, this uh, this last one on Monday, which was cool, and then uh, what was it uh, like Death Knight or something like that? I don't remember, uh, but yeah, there 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 have been a few people on and off, in and out. I just I don't know how willing people are to do that whole shtick, you know. All right, so I'm wondering if I have to or if I can pick those up. I don't know if you guys noticed this, but I'm fighting an outhouse here. Just FYI. <laughs> Everybody's throwing roses for me. What do you guys think? Is it going to be three hits, four hits, in order to get this guy down? I mean, if we go by typical gaming standards, it's three, right? But platformers tend to be a little bit more complicated. See, I told you. Incidentally, fun fact. So I'm super excited because uh, a while ago, not super long, but I noticed that there were some like uh, greatest hits games on sale for a PS4. Um, they were like ten bucks each. So I got uh, what I get. I got God of War, the the new one. I got um, I got Nathan Drake Collection, and I got was it The Last of Us? I'm trying to remember what the other one was that I that I got. But either way, I'm excited. I'm like wicked stoked. Dang it, now this is gonna bug me. Um, was it This Is Us? It might have been This Is Us. But either way, I'm super excited because I got it and it's fun. I also shared my fancy Amazon wish list. Hey, what the fudge? So, this is a boss that very much has multiple phases. That's always fun. Okay, here we go. 
Sorry, I, I'm not paying attention to the uh, to the chat right now on account of this dude is trying to kill me and very nearly succeeding. But too bad for him. I'm amazed balls. How amazed balls I am. I'm a little bit worried about my health. Still okay. Man, this guy has a lot of phases. Where is your final form, sir? The people have a right to know. Hey, this was his final form. Hooray! And with one health left. Go, Danny. You're awesome. Good job. My soul escaped into the outhouse. I don't know why, but doesn't matter, because I did the thing. Hooray! What is this? <laughs> it's poopery. Ah. Get my girlfriend to design something? I might. She's busy with all the other stuff, though. So, it's, I mean, I don't know. I mean, how do we define cool? I don't know anything about what's cool anymore. See, because I'm not cool. Like, fundamentally. <laughs> At least that's what I, that's, that is what I understand it to be. Right? Now, 100%, that was toilet, of, that, that was super toilet, right? I mean, it had to have been. Like, that's just obvious. So, I need to figure out how these little things work. Um, I guess I just need to go into the level and figure those out or something. But yeah. Lean, lean, hard nerd. I mean, definitely. That's what I would have to do, right? Okay. Um, I don't really know how to explore the, the forest. I, I'm just sort of guesstimating here. <laughs> Did my girlfriend's kid tell me I'm not cool? No, she, she often thinks that I'm cool. So I want to see if I can find these mysterious other things here. You weren't expecting to get your soul back. Well, too bad. Don't I do it? I'm trying to think of what I would need to do here. is I don't have access to the other images now. At least I don't think I do. So I don't remember what they look like. I remember there was one it looked kind of like that well. But not exactly. Oh! Oh no! No one saw that. I don't know what you're talking about. Anybody who says otherwise is a liar and or a thief and or a hater. Tiny tells you that you're not cool. I think that you're cool, Marathawin. I think you're super cool. Does that mean anything? Does it mean something if I say you're cool? But yeah, I've been debating about doing like shirts or hats or something. I, I know there's a ton of places that allow you to do that. And I know there's a bunch of streamers that do it too already. Um, it's just for me, I, I don't know if it's worth it. I mean... My, my whole shtick is... Ah. Yeah, I know. We already saw this. Um, 
for for my purposes, the the way I see it is like I never viewed streaming as a real way to get any money. Um, like that was there was just something that I never viewed as possible. So um, so yeah, I just never thought about actual merchandising in in any way. So, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll do something at some point. Who knows? But yeah, if you guys have fun ideas, then do do let me know. Like uh, ideas for shirts or hats or whatever that you'd actually wear. Because <laughs> I think that's the biggest issue. Is that I can think of fun stuff, but... I mean, one of the biggest issues, of course, is going to be copyright. Like, I, I own my little pixel image thing, uh, but beyond that, um, I would need to make sure that I use anything that's, um, what's it called, um, Creative Commons and all that kind of stuff, because that is not my area of expertise whatsoever. It would basically just be like a fun font with what's the death count or something like that, I imagine. Kind of like what I did with the uh, badges. Do something similar to that and just say what's the death count. I think that would be a fun shirt. And plus I could wear it on stream. And then everybody would be wicked jelly. <sighs> Dang it. I don't know exactly why I'm exploring this way. I can technically go to other locations now. I just want to try to finish this off. This place is so spooky. I do think it's kind of cool that they do that though. They um, they really hit hard on the um, thematic aspects for this game, which I really like. Hoping beyond hope that this leads to something useful. So I'm spending a lot of time getting to it. it. Has to be something good, right? All up in the tops of the trees here. I see a treasure chest. Unfortunately, I'm not seeing anything else near here. Dweller Mask. Interesting. I'm not sure if I had seen that before. But it's good to know that I've got other hats on the way. It's been a while since I got a new hat. So for anybody unaware, that's kind of the shtick with this game. And that's why you have... What the f Why didn't it let me use that? It must be because of the fire thing. Weird. This weird swampy thing. No, no, no! I don't want that huggle. Bad touch, bad touch! I don't 
don't see anything that's particularly useful here. Huh. I feel like there's... I feel like there's something to be done here. But I'm not seeing it, unfortunately. This is just where the well is. Oh, shoot. Hang on, sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna read the chat right after this, I promise. I'm just trying to focus. Like a boss. So let's take a trip around the other side here and see what, if anything, we can see. Doesn't look like there's anything of importance. I do like the fact that there's like some yarn or something over there. Ah, dang it. Take a look. Let's see. Look at it like a vanity project and not a way to make bank. Yeah. <laughs> Lord of the Kale shirts. I love it. That's hilarious. See that that I find awesome. Lord of the Kale. That's that's really funny. Oh, and now I can stitch my hat. how this is useful, but okay. Nice! So it's just a, a temporary um, thing for that, essentially. Okay, that's kind of cool. At least get the yarn for something else. I genuinely don't know where to go. Okay. Oh man. 
We could do that. We could uh, we could do like what's the death count? We could do Lord of the Kale. We could do Hail Kale because that was an adorable uh, painting. So that would be fun. I'm down for that. Uh, what else would be good? Hmm. I mean, there's there's a lot of options that I can see. I don't remember seeing that thing. I mean, that could be a lot of different things. I have no idea. We'll just leave it for now. Head out. I got other stuff that I can do. And now I have new stuffs, so that's good. Because I have new stuffs, that means that I'll potentially be able to uh, finish up other things I couldn't do. So like this is the movie studio one. So let's see if I'm able to do it now. I am! I can do the train rush. My street name is NES Hard. That's horrible. It's just horrible. Where am I running? I don't want to run. Go on in. We're getting ready to shoot the, the movie. Hey, I'm, I'm in, Bob. Viewing this as just straight up one. I, I don't know if I'm supposed to save guys. Oh, if they're good, bad, or in between, or otherwise. Action star, you guys. This is intense. Ooh. I just wanted to get that twenty seconds. Hardcore. That was fun. 
I like that one. Now I'm curious to see what increases or decreases the um, the score for this one. The reckless detonator. What? What? DJ Grooves to win. I like him more. Let's do a conductor. score. So that basically means I have to redo that level. I won't redo it though. Okay, that's at the parade. I recognize that. That looks like it's in the Murder on the Owl Express one. So I won't worry too much about that right now. Honestly, I don't know what those weird little timepiece detected things are. Um, I think I went into one of them. I think it was this one actually. Um, so it's it's like basically just a, a small level. It's like a secret hidden thing. So I already did this one, so I'm just going to exit out. It's a cool little thing, but I already did it. So I'm amazing already, so it's fine. Incidentally, since you guys are here now, I hope that you all had a good week and, an, and a fun holiday. I mentioned it earlier, but... But I don't think anyone was here to hear it. It's very sad. Now, uh, where was... Oh, there it is. I need to go back to the Mafia one. Because I don't think I finished this one. I still don't have the items to beat the race? Jeez. It's ridiculous. Insane. How do I not have the item yet? Well, that's it for that. So I, I checked that one, I checked that one, and I checked that one. So I think that's all I can do right now. Did I just like hip thrust the wall to open it? <clears throat> it is a very fun game, Marathon. Thank you again. So incidentally, Marathon's the one who got this for me. So I was very excited. Because I find it to be quite dorbs. Wow. This is a messy, messy ba basement. This is terrible. So basically, you can't get in here unless you have the hook shot. I guess is the shtick. Free roam! Oh, oh, whoa, what? Oh, that's cool. Sure, yeah, yeah. I'm tired though. I'm exhausted from like the last three days. Now apparently, I have to find time to make shirts. God. People are relentless. I'm just saying, that looked like ivy that I can climb up, like in any other game. Like, ever. This is so cool. So this is what I was talking about when I said that I, I really like the um, the different worlds that they have in this game. It's really impressive. It's just 
so cool to see all of the, the different designs that they've got. This free roam thing is a little bit odd though. So I'm, I'm, I'm wondering what happens with it and what the, what the shtick is with it. I'm like 90% sure that my character is tripping right now. Whoa. This reminds me of ski lifts. So there are some ski lifts that work like this. They don't have the big benches. Instead, they're, um, there's essentially like a like a, a little hook circle thing, and you basically like latch yourself onto it, and then it'll pull you up. It's kind of weird, but that that's what that really reminded me of. I don't know much about the goats up here, but if you get in there, the goats. Great, now I've got problems with goats. This kind of reminds me of the, uh, um, like Crash Bandicoot in Spyro games a lot. Um, because you have that same sort of collectathon feel with the really, really um, vastly different and unique worlds and stuff that you're going around. Blow the horns. I don't have anything that does any sort of wind. Hi, yeah. Oh, there it is. That's what it's talking about. It's like tube and throat singing. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> Goats are the best by definition. They are, if you use the acronym GOAT. I, I don't know if this was referring to the acronym, however. Good lord! That's a lot of new roots. The fudge. I've cleared Goat Village. Well, go me. <laughs> Get it? Cause goat is like go to me. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. It's hilarious, and you all are just lame. I'm going to Bird Pass Fork. house. I don't know what that is. It sounds scary. Brewing yarn? The fudge? Give me something good, bro. I don't know what path I want. I don't know where I'm going. Yeah. 
Did, did I did I swing towards the past? I don't know. Ah, thank you, Tiny, for the bit. I appreciate it. You're awesome. There is a horn at the top. Good to know. Eh. Guys, I'm standing on nothing. I'm amazing. Did y'all see how I was standing on nothing? Alright, well, I don't see how I can get to the top. Nice. Unless it's a different top that it's referring to. Evil birds! Remember, kids, when all else fails, hit it. In video games, not in real life. It's a very bad idea in real life. Good thing I got that checkpoint! I was super smart there. He's a guy who just just has no idea. He just does doesn't have a clue. Cling. Y'all are so mean to future Danny. He puts food on the table. So now I have to go back the other way in order to go the other direction. There we go. Shaka. 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 I'm just wondering what the point of this particular area is. Because I'm genuinely not seeing it. Yeah, yeah, I need my brewer hat. the wrong button. Almost, but not. Oh, incidentally, fun fact, if you guys are are into that sort of thing, um, you know, the, um, the autumn sale for um, Steam is going on right now. So now is the time to pick up some games if you haven't done so, um, or if you've been looking for some. Uh, I myself finally caved and I picked up Skyrim uh, for PC. I've had it for um, Xbox. I had it basically since it came out, but I got it on um, Xbox 360, so I, I was old school on that one. But yeah, I, I finally picked up the like super awesome collector's edition, whatnot, etc., on a PC. So one could say that I'm pretty awesome. I wish that you could aim this a little bit better. I feel like there's no way to aim it. It's close. 
She actually said. All right. I don't know why I'm actually doing this. I, I'm still looking for horns, I guess. I have no idea. Well, I don't want to leave this place. I want to go get all the other stuff. Isn't there a horn that I need to go find? Oh, this was this was not a ideal option. Okay, that's... Oh, crap. I'm like inside the geometry. It's... Ah, oh, see, I could have made it. I could have done it, you guys. You don't know. Y'all don't know me. I still don't understand why we're calling future Danny a jerk. He's a cool dude. You know, he works hard for his money. He's even done some of his Christmas shopping already. I'm just saying. Cause he's cool like that. Tries to do it early. Got some good deals on stuff. I mean, to me though, the birdhouse sounds like I don't know, some kind of a weird torture place. It's like, take him to the birdhouse. And it's like, no, not the birdhouse! Anything but the birdhouse, no! Alternatively, I'm just weird. Did me dirty. The fudge. Not cool, man. You want a piece of me? It's right. for some stupid ice yarn. Oh. I, oh. Well, in that case, go me. Look at how amazing I am. Oh, bugger. Ha. See that recovery. This feels like Okay, nobody told me that it wasn't solid geometry, okay? That is not my fault. 100% not my fault, okay? If I come all up in here and see a big giant spiky thing sticking out of the wall, I'm going to make the assumption that it is a big giant spiky thing sticking out the wall. Ain't nothing wrong with thinking that. That's all I'm saying. I wonder if it still counted me completing this one. Because that would be nice. Because I don't want to have to fight that bro who did me dirty again. And irrefutably, he did do me dirty. Ha! See? 
Okay, good. Oh, you see that precision? What? Remember, kids, I am the preeminent slow runner of all things gaming. And it's okay for you all to be jealous. So this must be the birdhouse. Told you. Y'all don't listen to me. Um, shoot. I gotta get going, unfortunately. I'll see if I can do this quickly. I, I'm not a hundred percent that I can, but I really want to try. I mostly don't, I, I mostly just don't want to lose my progress. Does anybody have anything fun planned for today? I'm just doing like a bunch of my usual stuff personally. Like I said, I gotta work and whatnot. One thing I really have to do that I haven't done in what feels like forever is do a, another behind the scenes video thing. I um, this past weekend I I made some some fun updates to my um, to my fish tank especially, and so I wanted to share those. Sadly, I've already lost some sediments because that is my luck. Now there's obviously a lot additional to explore here, but unfortunately, uh, with my time constraint, I, I'm just gonna do what I can. Oh shoot. Well, that was dumb on my part. another egg was going to pop out. Oh. Okay, well that's good to know. Oh, you're going to get the new Star Wars game? Nice! The Fallen Order, you mean? Sounds super wicked cute. I genuinely don't see how I can get across there. It seems like it needs to extend the little doodad. I'm not seeing.
I saw something that I can do. I saw a place I can go. Um, wait, what, what happened? Um, so I have not heard back from the, uh, from the company about my table, no. Um, I did, uh, I, I don't know if I mentioned, but I, I did, I did finally get a message about it on Board Game Geek. The guy responded, and so I sent him an email. Um, he responded to the email relatively quickly, but, and, and he was like, okay, we'll, we'll take care of this like today slash tomorrow and that was a uh, week and a half ago almost at this point so I I have no idea basically I, as, as far as I'm concerned I it's nothing now so it kind of sucks But either way, yeah, I heard that the uh, Fallen Order got got really good reviews, so I, I would not mind playing that myself. But definitely uh, do do share share your experiences with it, Rev. I'm really curious what you think, because it's been a long time since I got a new Star Wars game, and it would be nice to hear that one of them's actually good. So unfortunately, I've got to get going. Uh, I need to get to work now. But it was great as always. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I, I'm really liking this game. I'm having a blast with it. It's nice because it's reasonably challenging, but it's not ridiculously challenging. It's, um, it's, a, it's a fun little platformer, very reminiscent of, you know, like Banjo-Kazooie, Mario 64, Crash, Spyro, all of those kinds of things, where it's cute, but at the same time, it makes you think at least a little bit. It's really nice. But, yeah, it should be fun. So you guys take care. <gasps> I get present! Oh, yay! Thank you so much, Rev. I really appreciate that. That's awesome. I, I, that's really, really amazing of you. Everybody, for everybody. I mean, for your subscriptions, for all the bits, for everything that you guys do. I truly appreciate it. You guys are super awesome. So I, I'm looking forward to seeing what it, what it is. It should be awesome. So, yeah. Oh, I, I will definitely keep an eye out. Um, we'll we'll see we'll see what it says. Hopefully, it'll be um, a mailbox delivery. If not, I think my girlfriend's going to be home most of the day, so she'll be able to pick it up. But either way, you guys take care of yourselves. Have a great weekend. I will be back on Monday. Um, we'll be back with some uh, some more Chrono Trigger, and just sort of moving on, moving forward, doing our thing. Um, so yeah, have a fun rest of the weekend, and let's get get ready to go back to work. Woo! But you guys take care. Have a fun time, and I'll see you around.